this is a weekly reading for Cancer the Crab. Um, <laughs> your two songs are Satankin, Lie Lie Lie, and Queen Radio Gaga. Uh, my chicken scratch isn't getting any better. Um, yeah. I wrote too small, so that's gonna be a problem. Anyway, as you know, you feel like the strength card in reverse. So, Leo, um, sign in reverse. Inability due to weakness of body or spirit, sickness, drive of empiric um, knowledge at the expense of others. Um, difference um, to others' thoughts and feelings. And let's see. You have the Empress. Empress. Alright. Um, the Empress is a mother figure as well as a sister figure, a wife figure, or a marriage. There could be a marriage going on. Um, she is all aspects of the female influence. She makes decisions based on humanity and not her own best interests. Through they often intersect. Um, a good partner, practical, decisive, intuitive, uh, motivator. So, there's that. And then we have your challenge, which is the Wheel of Fortune. Isn't it always? It's just not on your side. Um, a Wheel of Fortune, birth and death, um, anything um, unusual or beyond conscious control, the beginning of the and the ends, resolution, um, good and bad luck, going towards, going forwards, or retreating into trouble. Positive or negative, um, depending on surrounding cards. So as as much as this is fun, uh, that means that this would be a very hard time to be lucky, <laughs> um, which being unlucky isn't that bad either, but, you know, some people. Alright, so, a lesson to remember this week is the Two of Pentacles, um, fearing the consequences of a new project, worry, embarrassment, looking into the infinitive, so it could be a work-related thing, or it could be a personal one. But what, what I'm going to say is that if it's important to you, it's going to be important to other people that care and support you. So, uh, that kind of thing. And then we have the Nine of Swords in reverse. Um, suspicion of a close friend, imprisonment, and gossip, shame, timidity, um, and reasonable fear. So there's some somebody who has fear, maybe it's you, maybe it's them, but um, there's some kind of fear going on, which is very borderline. Maybe they fear the future. Most of us do. Um, but yeah, there's, there's not really much to fear in the future. It's just going to be a bunch of craziness. Um, yeah. Be, being intuitive isn't, like, the best thing to be, um, because you know too much. Anyway, the, your gift of the week is going to be the Five of Swords, um, a grave defeat, possibly a final battle, infantry and dishonor, new enemies arising, and a disaster. I told you the future wasn't all that great. Uh, a gift this week, yeah. And I even hope that this week was going to be better. I think it is a little bit better, but, you know, what, what do I know? Anyway, so, I think it's all about, like, a final decision, which is, you know, you could have made your final decision. I mean, you don't need other people to make it, because... If you're a people pleaser, <laughs> that that's a really shameful thing to be. Like my mom always said, don't be a people pleaser. Please yourself first, and then it's fine. Anyway, cancer the crab. If 
you like this video, leave a like. If you like what I'm doing on here, subscribe. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, ideas for my next video, um, leave them in the comment section below. And thank you for watching. I know my closing sounds so sadistic after I tell people bad news. Um, I don't mean to be, but people get all mad. Anyway, I will see you in the next video. Bye now.